Hello, in this video I will explain where Clarity files are stored and how they are organized. Let's start with the folders in the Clarity directory. There are four different folders. The bin folder, that holds the software itself, including tools like the IQ and Launch Manager. The CFG folder, that contains all the station setting files and audit trails. The data files folder, that contains all the chromatographic data. The documentation folder, that includes data sheets and manuals for this version of the software. And a file uninstall.exe used to uninstall Clarity. The CFG and data files folders contain all the station specific data, so you can back up both of these folders and use them if needed. Now, let's take a closer look to the configuration folder. In this folder, you find for example configuration files, that direct which devices you have on the instruments, and desktop files, that store user-specific settings. It also stores the audit trails and diagnostic data. So if you need to transfer or retrieve the settings of the station, the following files will be necessary. Any present configuration, .cfg, and desktop, .dsk files, and clarity.psw file. Now, I will show you the structure of the data files folder. Clarity uses a project based structure, so in the data files folder you can find common folder that contains shared files for all projects like report styles or templates. Folders for every project of your Clarity. And projects folder that contains individual project files corresponding to each existing project. Next. I will illustrate the structure inside folder for each project. Directly in the folder belonging to each project, you can find all methods, sequences and SST files of the project. There are also two subfolders by default. Calib, that stores calibration files, and chromatograms measured as standards or blank sample types. Data, that stores chromatograms of unknown samples, or bypasses. We strongly recommend sticking to this file structure, because placing files in different locations can break links between files and cause unexpected behavior. You can create additional subfolders inside the Calib or Data folders to further organize chromatograms. Please do not place subfolders anywhere else. For more details, Please see the video how to create chromatograms in subfolders. Thank you for your attention. For more videos, check our YouTube channel.